To obtain a classroom webcam with tripod, visit the Academic Technology Center ATC in the library. A link to their website is available in the notes for this video. This allows you to have an additional webcam that can be set up to show a view of the students in the classroom, as well as providing a microphone that would allow attendees on Zoom to hear the students in the classroom better. Keep in mind that some classrooms have built-in classroom webcams and microphones, so this webcam may not be necessary. Remove the tripod from the bag and any plastic wrapping. Open all of the latches on each tripod leg so you can extend the leg. Close the latches once you have extended the leg as far as you would like. Repeat this for each leg. Place the provided webcam on the tripod. You may need to maneuver it a little to fit. The easiest place to connect the webcam is a USB port on the instructor monitor. Simply plug it in and it will connect within a few seconds. If you find that the monitor USB port won't work for your needs, you can also choose to connect the webcam to a USB port on the computer tower in the instructor cabinet. You won't be able to close the cabinet and you'll need to be mindful of how you set up the tripod so you and your students don't trip over the cord. On the instructor computer, start the Zoom meeting if it is not already running. Then click Start Video. If there are multiple cameras, you may find that Zoom is not displaying the camera you want to show. To change your video source, click on the caret icon next to the video button. Choose the camera that you want to display. In this example, you can see that there are two Microsoft webcams connected to the computer. The classroom webcam with tripod uses the same model of webcam as the instructor webcam installed on the monitor of the instructor podium. So in this case, Zoom is showing the instructor webcam, so I just need to choose the other Microsoft webcam to switch to the classroom webcam. In general use classrooms with an instructor Mac, a Logitech webcam is installed, so you will simply want to choose the Microsoft webcam to select the classroom webcam. You'll also notice that the Elmo document camera appears as a camera since I turned on the document camera. View the video on using the document camera with Zoom for more information on using that camera. Now the classroom webcam should be showing in Zoom. You can switch between cameras at any time using these same steps. To use the classroom webcam for your audio as well as video, click on the caret icon next to the microphone button. Select the same webcam you selected for your video source. If you have multiple webcams with the same name, you'll most likely need to test the audio to determine which one you want to select. Classroom webcams are able to swivel 360 degrees as well as tilt up and down, so you can adjust the webcam to show different parts of the classroom as needed during your class without having to move the tripod.